Hi everyone and welcome to The Ultimate You. In today's video, I'll be demonstrating a hand and arm massage. This type of massage can be incorporated when your client is under the dryer, getting his or her hair dried, or it can also be included in a manicure service, and it can also be included in a facial treatment service. So stick around, come along with me and enjoy. So we start by <clears throat> applying some oil to your hand. You rub your palms together, have it nice and warm and then you apply it to your client's hand. With applying the oil, you want to use nice long strokes, which is known as effleurage. And feel free to add more oil if needed. You're going to add more to your hand. Warm it up. And then you apply it to cleanse and arm. So long strokes, turn and come down. Long strokes, upward, turn. And as you come down, you hold the middle of the hand firm, the arm firm. You want to do this about three or four times. As you come down, you pull your fingernails, fingers. You then move to this movement. You're holding your wrist, the client's wrist, interlocking your hand with her hand. And you're going around and then the opposite direction. You take out your hand and then you are going with circular effleurage movements to the palm. You're using your thumb fingers for this massage movement. You can go three to four times upward circular downward circular upward circular downward circular you can include more effleurage movements as you proceed to the other massage movement You then go to your little finger and you're ringing it four times to the right, four times to the left. You proceed, you repeat this on every, ex, um, every finger. You want to ensure that your movements are firm, but you're also taking your time so that your client can feel relaxed during this massage. It is also important to ensure that your client isn't wearing any hand jewelry while this massage, while you are doing performing this massage. You do not want to be held liable for the damage of any piece of jewelry and it is also not professional.
We're then going to do friction. We're just going to be wringing the hand upward and wringing it downward. It's a rhythmic, rhythmic movement. And again, you can do this three to four times. Continuous movement, so no stopping as you perform that. Any massage movement. You perform some more effleurage. And then you end off with your tapament movement where you are lightly tapping your fingers up and down the client's arm and hand. Up, down, up, down. You're using the base of your fingers. As you are coming to an end of the the end of the massage, you are gently and lightly removing your fingers from the client's hand, and that's it. Thank you for viewing. Hope you enjoyed.